Of all the specialized equipment in an automotive machine shop, the crankshaft grinder is possibly the most unique. We're documenting the rebuild of this N62 Continental engine from a Massey Harris Pony tractor on our YouTube channel, and right now we're grinding the rod journals of the crankshaft for undersized connecting rod bearings. The chucks of the grinder have been offset by one half of the stroke length of the crankshaft, such that the entire crankshaft rotates around the centerline axis of the middle two rod journals. As the grinding wheel first makes contact with the journal, the remaining dark spots show the wear from this engine's previous life cycle. Once the journal is completely shiny, indicating that the wear has been cleaned up, we'll stop a moment to take a quick measurement. After a bit of math, we can see that we need to take an additional five thousandths and three tenths off the diameter of the journal to hit our desired size tolerance. An Arnold in-process grinding gauge is then set up, which will tell us the exact diameter of the journal as we bring it down to the finished size. Turning the hand wheel will feed the grinding wheel into the workpiece, but as we get closer, the button is used to feed the grinding wheel in precise two-tenth increments. There's a one-thou tolerance on diameter, but we like to stay just inside the high side of spec. 